Going up against Phil Tufnell in a survival trial, the challenge proved too difficult for Joe who was unable to complete it faster than his opponent. As the two men were locked inside a tomb, they had to try and unlock four padlocks by trying a series of possible combinations that were located around them. With dozens of snakes being poured in while they tried to stay calm under pressure, Joe couldn't see the numbers on his lock as one of the snakes went over his goggles. Announcing Phil as the winner, Joe told presenters Anton Deck he feels too old to be taking part as he's now a different person from who he was when he first appeared back in 2008. Saying his goodbyes and leaving the show, Phil headed back into camp where he was reunited with his campmates, although little did he know he'd be forced to endure another trial. During the episode, the remaining stars were told they would all be taking part in a second survival trial. Although in an unexpected twist, they all learned two people who failed to complete the challenge in the quickest time would be leaving instead of just one. As they're all individually locked into a crate with nothing but their heads poking out, they're tasked with untangling a key from a series of cords. They then have to unlock the padlock which is keeping them trapped inside and ring a bell while a series of critters are poured in. Don't miss! Susanna Reed forced to step in over out of touch monarchy debate, video, Camilla's coronation fears betrayed by her hands, expert says, Royal, the cast of Rising Damp now from untimely death to Harry Potter's stint, insight, so far, only Fatima Whitbread, Carol Vorderman and Mylene Class were the ones who managed to get out and get a spot on the survivor's bench. In a teaser for Wednesday night's episode, it showed there are still five stars locked in their crates as they struggle to break free. Viewers will watch either Jordan Banjo, Helen Flanagan, Paul Burrell, Phil Tufnell or Dean Gaffney exit the show on tomorrow's installment, losing a spot in the upcoming finale. Speaking about his recent departure, Joe Swash revealed he found his time in the South African jungle amazing. He said, it was such an amazing group of people that made me and Dean feel immediately welcome. I don't think I've laughed as much for years. Honestly, my ribs were so sore from laughing. It was quite an overwhelming experience as well because the jungle means so much to me. As in, I worked on it for over a decade. I met my wife on there, and I've now had children. It was so nice to go back in there. It all sort of came back to me how much the show has done for me. It was lovely. It was really nice to go back and sort of say thank you. That was a big part of returning for me. I'm a celebrity. South Africa continues weeknights on ITV from 9pm.